And welcome back to Flexible Games, where we are playing Production Line. Looks like our keyless entry finally came through. Uh, we are going to charge a good premium on that. 500 bucks for a keyless entry. We can do that for a little while, and then we're going to start lowering our prices soon, probably. So let's redo this paint setup. We need two paint finishes in here. So uh, if we do one out this way, one out this way, and then I can do, hmm, how do I want to do this? Do I want to redo this one as well? Because we're going to be putting a lot of cars into here. Um, this is kind of tricky. Um, I might have to forego this last resource importer in order to make this work. But let's let's look at this. Uh, all the cars in here are just going to have to be a loss, I guess. And let's see what we're going to have to do about painting. So if we do paint undercoat, if we have one here and one here, okay, then we'll bind them up, go in the middle, and then combine two dryers. So let's let's. Let's mock this up a little bit. So one here, I don't want to put this one here because it'll stock up. So if I do one here, one here, okay? Uh, and then the conveyors are gonna come out, up, and in, and then up here, okay? And then the dryers, uh, dry here, here, Uh, here, here. Oh, we're quickly running out of room. I could do another one here as well. And then the paint finish, same, same deal. Um, paint finish here. And then dry here. Wait, those are those are these are pointing out. Okay, so dry needs to point in like this. So I do those right. See these loop up and around. These do not. Uh, so dry. I could probably, if I if I wrap this around, I would be able to put a dry here. Dry here. Two dries for this one. And that's about all she wrote for that side, unfortunately. Or I could put one, this is a really expensive, really expensive process here. Dry here, dry here, dry here. So that's one, two, three, four. So this one would wrap around connect to there, connect to here, come down, connect to all these. Can I put another one in here somewhere? Uh, I would be able to put one, oh no, I couldn't put one there. I could put one, yeah, this is a little tricky. I wish I could offset them a little bit going down. Uh, my brain hurts. Okay, so we got a paint. We got two paints here. If I got rid of this one, if I got rid of this dry, uh, that would be 
that would add that would give me a little bit of extra space to wiggle in um but it would also limit me to four here i've got three i could put a fourth here pretty easily um i can't put one down here because we've got we got this conveyor actually these dries okay sat nav is unlocked i'm just going to kind of go down the line i'm actually going to pause it because we're bleeding money right now because we're not actually pushing any cars through uh, okay so i got to rethink this because these are coming out and these are going to come up and wrap up and in so that is that is an issue that we're going to have to deal with here um yeah, this is just not enough space to do a whole lot in. Um, let's see. I could forego this and have the dryers go in each side here. And that would give me this space. And then the dryers would all come out. So that would give me two, but it would eliminate this one. Okay, is two dryers enough for one of these? That's three minutes, and that's 12 minutes. It, it would take four dryers to equal the speed of one of these painters. So yeah, we're, we're already really short on dryers. Um, how do we wanna do this? Okay, this is hurting my brain, so I'm going to get rid of all of these. Okay, so let's set, look at this again. Trying to solve problems in real time here is not easy to do. So if we have a paint here, we could put a paint over here. So I could, I could have two paints. I could have one here and one here. So that saves, that saves a little, that saves a little room. So each one of these is going to come out right here and here and need to come up somewhere to dry. Okay, so dry can be here, here, here. and one on the end. Because I can always upgrade these to be a little faster. Okay, so paint finish, I can do the same thing. I can have one here and one here. And that saves me a lot of vertical room right here. So I'm gonna put one here and here. Because those will split off. And then dry finish. We'll have one here. I can put one. Okay, this is this is bad. Um, one. and up here because I can't I could put one here and then the conveyors would be really messy in this area like that And then these have to come out and up and then across and down. Sort of like that. And then this can go up, this can go up, this can go up and across. Okay, and then these have to come up and in. And that one. 
Okay, so I think that's four dryers on each. That's one, two, one, two, three, four, five on this one. But four on this one. Okay, well, that is a tricky situation. Um, so paint, paint undercoat. We're gonna need one here and here. Conveyor goes here and here. Fortunately, we lose that car too. That kind of sucks, but uh, yeah, we're gonna need to come out here and here. Okay, so that kind of overhauls the paint situation. Now I need some conveyors for this. I have another importer that I can actually use up here now that I've uncovered that and we can use use that there. Uh, and one more right there. Right there. Okay, I think everything is covered. And now we just need the upgrades. I'm gonna I'm gonna start it back up again. And let the whole system continue. Okay, so we're gonna need we're gonna need the uh, drying upgrades up here definitely. So faster drying, faster drying. That doesn't cut a whole lot of time off the dryer, does it? I might need to research the next level of drying speed up, but oh come on, use use the other dryers for goodness sakes. Now are you gonna use this one? Nope. You? Nope. How about this one? Nope. <laughs> oh goodness how about this one nope why why do you hate me wow this that, that filled up fast didn't it okay there's a couple ready there We got two, we got both of them being used here, which is good. I'd like to see that. A lot of dryers being used up here, which is also good. I'd like to see that. Now, are you going to go over this way? Yes. Look at that. Uses them nicely. Ooh, there's no, there's no output here. I just noticed that. Okay. That'll help that along. Everything else is connected and linked up. I'm not seeing any other errors. Looks like we are good to go on that front. Excellent. Okay, what other options have we unlocked? Uh, we have sat nav. So let's go. I think that was, where was that? Sat nav is in fit electronics. So fit electronics upgrades. Sat nav. I'm going to do sat nav on one of these. So the one is going to be without and one is going to be with. Just to give some variety to what I'm doing here uh, as we get as we get these going. Uh, I will make sure we, you know, keep it randomized. You know, keep it sort of open-ended where everything goes. Uh, what sort of upgrades are on the dashboard? Heater, driver, airbag, passenger airbag. Okay, so airbags. I'm definitely going to charge a premium for the airbags because those ain't cheap either. And those are something we can't make either. I don't think we... Yeah, we can't make airbags. It looks like we are pretty backed up on our line from all that, all those paint shenanigans that we were going through. But uh, everything's working out so far. It looks like we are keeping up with the output. And it looks like the dryers over here have started to sort of backlog a little bit. All right. 
Just queue those up. Lots of cars going through now. So as these get done, uh, we should see them start using both lines because this one's going to use this and then this one will go beyond into the next one. Okay, automatic windscreen wipers are done. I want to research power steering. Yeah, power steering. Uh, okay, so that was automatic windscreen wipers, which is fit windscreen. Okay, so fit windscreen. Uh, I think this one, is this the sat nav one? No, this one is. Okay, so we're going to do automatic windscreen wipers. I need to start researching some of the makes too. Uh, let's look at prices really quick. Okay, we are looking at door panels being, look at that, 16 grand in door panels. I might want to research door panels. What are the door panel prices here? $238 and we're doing four on each car. Uh, so yeah, we are, it's like the price fell as we weren't buying them for a while and now the price is gonna go back up again. It's 16 grand in door panels. That ain't cheap. So we might want to start making our own door panels. That is a monster craft system. Okay, we have now in car no in car music. Sat nav. Okay, sat nav is 246. Uh, we're gonna need to increase that. I'm not sure how much sat nav is, but uh, we're gonna charge 100 percent on that. So, yeah, we're going to be, I'm going to check, 339 that we're getting for that. Let's see how much those sat navs cost. Uh, prices? Uh, S. Sat nav, 117, okay, so, yeah, we're going to make a pretty decent return on uh, the sat nav for a while. That's good. I like Mason. I like making a good return on stuff. Oh, this is five minutes. We're gonna we're gonna buy the extra robots for each one of these. Kind of cut that down a little bit so there's less waiting. I didn't think fit steering wheels took so long, but hey, you know, it is what it is. I was like, that's gonna be our bottleneck for a while. But the system is going again. Uh, we have plenty of seats, and we shouldn't be importing any more seats. And we don't have any upgrades available. Ooh, ooh, uh, uh, robots, we don't really need that. But So are there any upgrades to the seats themselves? No. OK, so we can't. We can't upgrade the seats when we make them. We have to, we have to upgrade them later on. Where is what is that thing? What is that? Sensor. Okay. Sensors and servos for automatic wipers. This one isn't getting automatic wipers. Uh, how much are windshields? Uh, so those would be in W. 215 so it's 215 dollars a car which i'm guessing it's going to be too glass to make one of those uh which is roughly 56 dollars so we would save i don't know 160 dollars per per car for that wheels however would would probably go a long ways to help us out uh, sunroof we can't make. Uh, steering wheel, wow, that's steering wheels aren't cheap, and I think it's a leather and a steel, uh, and leather is not cheap. So, yeah, leather is two hundred bucks. 
not a whole lot of savings to be had on anything with leather unless it's really expensive but this aircon unit i really want i really want to make my own air conditioners so power steering is done so let's let's just get the research for you know the air conditioner run done so we can start making our own i'm really curious to know what uh, ingredients go into that uh, and now we've got uh, the, the automatic wind no not keyless entry which power steering so fit steering wheel we're gonna need to add some power steering so down in here upgrades power steering and then upgrades power steering So both 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 sets here are gonna get power steering. And we're gonna to need to make start making our own wheels, tires, and brakes here soon because we've got a lot of them, a lot of them uh, being used. It looks like uh, we're keeping up with our lines here. Uh, what is that's that's two minutes. That's two minutes. Two twenty-five. We got a bigger backlog right in here than anything so I might need another fit door panels windows and wing mirrors and then bind that in with this paint line so this whole system or it's no oh, it's actually a little faster than normal Because we've got all of these cars backed up. It used to be backed up into here, and now it's not. So I might have to let it run for a little bit to see if it indeed is faster. But yeah, we've got we've got the uh, upgrade keyless entry on these door panels right now. All right, well, that'll do it for this episode. And I thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.